Welcome back to the Hockey Shop Source of Sports. I'm over in Goal Utopia with Cam Matwiv and the new True Skates. Catalyst Skates. I'm always having a little trouble with There you them. go. The nomenclature changes a fair bit. This is the 9X4 Catalyst Skate, all new. Correct. From True. Correct. Cam, walk me through. Oh, that was good. I could like, I could like have a rap album. All new, true, walk me through. I rhyme. Wow. Welcome back to the Hockey Shop Source of Sports. I'm Cam, he's Kevin, and today we're talking about the Catalyst True Skate. Look at that double intro. So, brand new, continuing off of the success of the uh, TF series of skates. Um, we have some major differences between the TF7, TF9. Um, there's now three price points, which is definitely worth talking about. Um, new technical price point with the 9X skate. So let's dive into that one first. So that's the top end. This is now Catalyst, the new top end. 9X4, that's the new true top end skate. Correct. So again, they want to take a lot of their thermal moldability and overall customizable fit to a bit of a degree from their custom skates and brought that down into what would be their stock line of skates that we're seeing okay, here. Okay, so hold on. This is the top stock off the wall option from Chu. Want to make sure we still clarify, you can still order the full custom, the one piece. Two piece. The, there you go. Yes. This is, this is sort of at the store, walk in. This is giving you the ability to get that custom fit. Retail, yes, correct. Um, so again, that super thermal moldable composite that they've been using still makes its return back in. Some added durability features right off the bat because they definitely are 100% worth touching on. Um, let's look at the back of the skate first, right off the bat. So before we had exposed carbon all the way through the back, we maybe seen some heel cracking issues with the older TF series, especially in the TF9. Um, a lot of that happened was as you're swinging and contacting the post or even your skate blade contacting the back of that skate as well, uh, was starting to weaken that carbon, punch holes through it, created some cracking issues. How is my skate blade touching the back of the skate? Blade? So if oh, you swing- Oh, their skate? Correct. Oh. Yes. Some of us don't ever do that camera. Uh, you'd be surprised at the amount of people that do. <laughs> okay. Um, even that leather strip, along the back with some extra padding as well can make all of that difference. It's now creating a new contact surface, a new impact surface to helping reduce some of those cracking issues that we did see. So again, to listen, saw it right off the bat. Crack uh, the code. Create crack the code as if you- rid of the cracks. Of getting, <laughs> got them. So side of the skate as well, we do see less of that exposed carbon. Uh, more of that full wrap, actually a feature they did find in their uh, custom skates on the upper, um, upper price point as well. Um, again, creating some protection for the outer side of the skate where we did see some wear issues before on the previous models. So let's talk about the fit of the skate and also a cool new feature. So nano fit is again, that talking about that thermal multiple technology. Nano fit. Nano fit. Okay, yes. so that's in, you got the high end. Is it I'm holding the second price point. Does it exist there? It exists in the second price that's point as well. To know. Yes. So, the cool factor of this skate is their new hinge. So, their motion cuff is what they are calling it. So, it's actually an insert that goes along the first two eyelets of the skate itself, allowing forward flexion when that goalie is now flexing and putting pressure forward. Hold on. So, there's an insert. I'm just talking about the actual cuff of the skate itself. So, plastic piece now comes through. First two eyelets, that's where its connection is. Now, it's creating that forward flex when you do create that pressure on me. So this, the, the bat, this isn't flexing. Like no. the, this is not all that's flexing. It's giving you the ability no, to flex forward in the tongue. On the inside, not on the tongue. It's actually inside the skate itself. So you will feel that overall. There's a moving point. piece in there. There's a moving piece in there. Okay, good to know. So you will find that on the 9X, 7X, not the 5X, because again, we got to take something out as we're going to that's tiered the, of the that's, price point. That's the third price point down the 5X there. So it doesn't exist. It exists in the top two. So, I mean, this solves for, I mean, we see it right up in the NHL. Most of the goalies wearing true don't do up top laces on their skates to try and establish a little forward flex and get a little mobility um, rather than being so locked in that, that you worry about injuries. So they, they, a lot of guys just don't do up the top two. This gives you the ability to sort of maintain a little more connection and a bit of forward flex. That's a great. Great Correct. Play I mean, it wouldn't be ripping still all the way up to the top eyelet super, super tight by any means, but it still might potentially allow that ability to that top eyelet, but still back it off a little bit with some, with some extra slack. Okay, I like it. Uh, overall, one other good call out. This is something that changed cool. on, I like this. on their custom skates. Now has been brought into their stock lineup. So we see that little indent that's actually at the toe of the skate. 
So what that will fit perfectly is actually the post. So as you're going to go now push off, you can hinge yourself into that post and push off with your so basically kind of nice. create a little gap for the fur to be on the post. That's correct. So in theory, your toe box, your pad up ceiling. Like it. I like that. That's that's cool. That's innovative. So as we're starting to tear down through the lineup, we see you see their DLC. So that's our carbon coated steel on the 9X. So the top end 9X4, better steel. This is just a regular stock stainless steel on the 7X4. And then we get into the 5X4, the, lo the lowest price point. And then we start to see more differences in terms of the overall liner of the skate itself. Um, and again, we don't have that same hinge flex um, on the 5. But the 7X has have that. Nice. So great options from True. If you want to give us a call, talk about it a little bit more. 604-589-8299 or 1-800-567-7790. Once again, custom is still available. Nothing has changed there. Um, so if, say, these stock fits don't work for you, you know, obviously there's that ability to go custom. But within the stock fit, there still is a fair amount of, because of the thermal molding, custom fit in terms of shaping it around your foot. That's in, correct. In store once you buy. That's correct. Nice. True. Catalyst, 9X4, 7X4, 5X4. Their new lineup, some new innovative features. If you got any questions, make sure you give Cam a call or check them out at thehockeyshop.com.